Morning, Eileen. Hi, Karen. Good morning. Yesenia, good morning. Hello, hello. Hola, good morning. Hey, teacher. morning, morning, Jesse. How are you? Hi, thank you, teacher. We're super nice. Okay. How are you, Eli? Ready for today's class? Yes, teacher, ready. Excellent. Do you usually have breakfast before the class or after the class? Uh, after. After. Okay, good. <laughs> Sophie is, is getting ready too. Hi, Sophie. Good morning. Veronica. Good morning. morning, morning. And Vero is here too. Nice. ¿Qué tal con este clima bonito? Super delicious, huh? <laughs> like Christmas, Sophie. <laughs> it's depressing. No way, really? Yes. Bueno, sí. Maybe now it's different because we are in the house and it's difficult. But I remember eh, este clima me recuerda a mi when I was a child, my childhood. Con, yes. mi, con mi gran este, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, discucha. <laughs> Quite. With my my huge kite, my my grandmother made the kites, mm -hmm. and she sold kites to all the children in the neighborhood. So I remember it was very nice. It was good, very nice. My friends, we have more people. We, uh, Elena, hello, Elena. Okay, and Gabby. Good morning. Welcome. Good morning. Again. Morning, Gabita. How are you? Morning, teacher. Much Hi. better. Okay, yes. <laughs> good, very nice. Estaba pensando yo, ¿por qué lo dolía el hombro? <laughs> Bien raro, a ver, no sé, nunca me había dolido. Oh, the, sometimes it's the stress. The, 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 the stress is concentrated in the, in the shoulders. This is one possibility. In my case, yeah. sometimes it happens. It happens to me. Sometimes, not always. Now I try to relax a little more. <laughs> yeah, okay. because when I really have a stress here, I have headaches and ah, my humor changes. So I, I better, you know, stay like calm. So I'm so happy to have you here, Gabby, once again. <laughs> okay. Francisco is here too. Okay. Francisco, Elena, Carlita Aguilar. Okay. Welcome to the class, guys. Okay. Thank Welcome you. to the, the, the next class we have. Okay. With the morning. Morning, morning, Carlita. Okay, with the section number, okay, we continue with the section number one. And we're going to practice, okay, today the, the models. Remember yesterday we started with can, could, would, and would you mind, okay? In this order, I said yesterday, in this order is the one that you are going to Okay, use depending on the level of confidence or level of, um, a, well, not respect because you have to respect everybody, but in the level of uh, formality, okay? First, we have very informal can, okay? The second one was a could, okay? The third one was would, pero sin mind, remember, would. Would you please, okay? And the very formal is, would you mind, okay? And also I said that after would you mind, you are going to use the verb in the ing form. But if would you mind has if, okay, don't uh, change the verb. The verb is in the normal okay way so these are exactly guys the stuff today we're gonna practice this okay and i'm going to start okay by showing okay this um this exercise that we are going to start doing okay después nos vamos con las respuestas okay so here my friends i have one two three four five five requests okay with would you mind, could, can, etc. Okay, so uh, what you have to do is to match 
the number one with the corresponding answer, okay? With the corresponding answer. So we're gonna read this, uh, the number five. So guys, if you please can take a picture of this, it would be very nice. Take a screenshot or take a picture because you're gonna work on this exercise first. Let's see request number one. Sophie, can you please read number one, Sophie? Yes. Could you please tell me the next time you have a party? Very good. Number two, this is for Jesse. Number two, read the, the request, please, Jesse. Can you turn the music down, please? Very good. Excellent. Number three, Francisco. Can you read number three, please? Okay, is would you mind closing the door behind you and making sure it's looks? It locks. Mm -hmm. Locks. It locks. Okay. Excellent. Uh -huh. Number four, Veronica, read number four, the request number four, please. Could you please help your guests to use the visitor parking space? Exactly. Very good. Number five, Gavi. Um, would you? Would you mind not putting your garbage in the hallway? Hallway, okay, very good. This is hallway, guys, says pasillo, okay? That's it. Then on your right, you will have the possible answer depending on the request you have, okay? So right now, okay, we are at a 25 to 25 to 7. I'm going to give you 10 minutes, okay, to finish this exercise. This is the only thing you have to do. For example, if Ileana is working with EXA, so Ili, you read the question, EXA, you answer, okay, the request. Then uh, go ahead, go over the, the questions or the requests and try to, in pairs, right, try to find the most suitable answer, okay? Then when we come back, we're gonna check some other possible answers that we can use when you ask for a request, okay? So let's see right now, depending on the number of students right now, we're going to work, okay? Uh, because of the number of students, some of you are gonna work in pairs and some of you are gonna work in trios, okay? As an invitation, please, 10 minutes right now for doing this exercise. Entonces coge a alguien más porque no las tengo. This is the, this is the exercise. No tengo, no tengo los. Yes. Es the, this ah. is the exercise, so you can take a picture. Uh, no yes, one. yes, I I have the picture. Ah, okay, excellent. I'm gonna. You're gonna share it, right? Yeah. Excellent, very good. Sure. Hi, Ili. Hey, you don't have a partner. What is Francisco? Francisco is supposed to be here. Maybe Frank is sleeping. <laughs> well, I'm going to send you to another group, okay? Accept the invitation, please. So you can work with the other guys. Do you have the exercise, guys? Hello, Jesse. Hello, teacher. Do you have the exercise? Uh, no, entendí, teacher. Do you have the exercise? Uh, el WhatsApp? No, el que les acabo de poner, este. Uh, uh -huh, ese es el que tienen que hacer. This is the one. Uh, okay. Take a picture, please. 
Don't make like a screenshot or okay. Uh, okay. you can work with them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Finish. Un momentito, un momentito. Okay. No. Listo. Okay, excellent. Hi, Frank. Hello. Really didn't. So the sound goes thrown to my apartment. Uh -huh. uh, I think it's the letter A. A. Uh -huh. uh -huh. okay. Teacher. Hello. 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 Hi, Sinia. Hello, morning. Okay, the number one you said is could you please tell me the next time you have a party? So the answer is letter E. Mm hmm. I like yes. to make sure I'm not at home. Oh. <laughs> so the person, <laughs> the person doesn't want to be in the party. <laughs> you know, I think so. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. It looks like like she or he doesn't like parties. Mm -hmm. Yo pensé que iba a ser como, hey, decime cuándo vas a tener para ir, vea. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> sí, but it's not, it's not like that. It's it's for not attending to the party. Yeah. Okay, great. Okay. Yeah, the next. Oh, no, 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 no. Let, let us see. I think that is for second question. Can you turn the music down, please? Uh, the mm -hmm. walls are really thin, so the sound goes out to my apartment. Is related to sound, music, sound. Mm hmm you know, like in, in, in the apartments here in El Salvador or the houses, they share the same wall and the wall is thin. When they say thin, it's delgaditas, right? Yes. Uh -huh. mm. So, mm -hmm. so number two is letter? Letter C. C. Mm -hmm. hey, would you mind closing the door behind you and making sure it's locked? We don't want stranger to enter the building. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Will you please tell your... Siento como cuando comienzan a editar las fotos que para ponerle bigotes a alguien o algo así, pero ahorita voy a, voy a hacer la, el dibujito para poner el número en cada pregunta. Ay, ¿cómo es el vida? I know. Y no me pude conectar. Hello, yeah. teacher. Hello, Vero. Mm -hmm. Finish? Yes. Oh. Yes. Okay. I, I will share the picture. Okay. I will share the picture. Okay. What do you have in the number one? Could you please tell me the next time you have a party? Letter E. Letter E, uh -huh. I like to make sure I'm not home. Okay, very good, excellent. Can you turn the music down, please? Letter C. Letter C. Letter C, read it, Pedro. The walls are really thin, so the sun goes through to my apartment. Very good, number three, Karen. Would you mind closing the door behind you and making sure it locks? Letter we don't want to, to strangers to enter the building. Okay, excellent. Number four, Araceli. Would you please tell your guests to use the visitor parking spaces? Um, 
Wait. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe let it A. Let it A. It's not very pleasant to see, okay, when <laughs> you won't know. <laughs> No, it's not letter A. Mm -hmm. Would you please tell your guests to use the visitor parking spaces? You know, parking spaces are not parqueos, right? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh, letter D. Letter D. Read it, please. A lot of, of a lot of cars have been using. Um, my space recently. Uh -huh, okay, my space recently. Very good. Would you would you mind not putting your garbage in the hallway? Okay, this is not letter A, right? Uh huh. Mm, it's not very pleasant to see when I walk by. Okay, that's it. Very good. So these are the answers. So nos quedamos one E, right? One E, two. A, C, three is B, four is D, and five A, right? That's the answer that we have. Do you have it similar? Yes. Okay, very good. So this is what we're gonna do together right now. We're gonna check it together, okay? To finish with this exercise. Thank you, girls. Now we're going to, okay, we are going to check, okay, your answers, okay, from this exercise. These are requests, okay, and we continue, okay, with a little bit more after the request, okay, like a little explanation, okay, about the request. Let's start with the number one. The number one is for my friend Sophie. Sophie, read the, read the, the request. And Gabby, you give me the corresponding matching. Okay. Could you please tell me the next time you have a party? Mm -hmm. um, I like to make sure I am not at home. At home. Very good. So this, guys, is letter E. Okay. Very good. Let's continue with the next one. The next request, please. Jesse. Read the request and EXA, you give me the corresponding matching. The two? Number two, yes. Can you turn the music down, please? Mm -hmm. EXA? The walls are really thin, so the sound goes throughout to my apartment. Okay, excellent. Letter C, very good. Next, Carlita Beatriz, read the request. Okay. And my friend Blanquita, you give me the corresponding answer. Okay. Teacher, sorry, what number is? Number three. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry. Okay. Uh, Would you mind closing the door behind you and making sure it locks? Uh huh. Very we good. don't want strangers to enter the building. Okay, we don't want a stranger to enter the building. So letter B, very good. Juan Carlos, read number four, please. And Francisco, you give me the corresponding matching. Okay. Uh, would you please tell your guests to use the visitor parking space? Mm -hmm. Very good. Frank? Okay. A lot of cars been, been, have been using my space recently. Okay, recently, uh -huh. very good, recently, very good. A lot of cars have been using my space recently, okay? And obviously, well, the last ones, right? Number five, Itzel, read the, 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 the request, and Sinia, give me the most difficult. <laughs> okay. Would Number you five. mind not putting your bargage? No, a garbage. 
Garbage. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, would you mind not putting your garbage in the hallway? Uh -huh. Very good. So what's the corresponding answer? Hello, Sinia. Sorry, teacher. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's the answer? Is the yep. letter, okay, uh, is the letter A. A, okay, read it, please. Okay, well, will you mind put, not putting your garbage in the hallway? Mm -hmm. Read the, the letter A, please. It's not very pleasant, pleasant, pleasant to see. Mm -hmm when I walk by. Okay, very good. Okay, excellent. Okay, these are the answers from this exercise that we have here, okay? Very nice. So, if you could see here, you know, when you may request in this case, is it's impossible. I was thinking about daily life. De verdad que es imposible, okay? No hacerle a alguien pedirle algo, right? Like, it's impossible to make requests to someone. Eh, our daily life is not just like, okay, being you alone. You need somebody else to do many things for you. So, eh, there are many, many requests that we use every day. Unconsciously or consciously, you made the request. So remember, depending on the, the level of formality in your conversations, you use request, okay? And you use the models. I said yesterday, can, could, would, and would you mind, okay? When you make a request, guys, okay? The other person can give you different answers. Here, please don't expect to say, can you help me with this? Uh, for example, can you help me with this homework? No esperen que le diga, yes, I can. No, this is not so natural, okay? Then in, in basic, okay, you, you, you learn that when the question is with can, you answer with can. Could, could. In this case, it's different, okay? Because they are not like, uh, questions specifically with this more than no. In this case, the answers can vary. They are very, you know, well, depending on the context, depending on the request, you give an answer. For example, imagine Itzel, right? And say, hey, Itzel, can you lend me $100? No, I said, no, I can. No, the first reaction from her is like, what? <laughs> oh, impossible teacher. I, 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 I run out of money right now, right? So you see, it's not just like, can you? Yes, I can, no. So there are different, okay, answers. I'm giving you here possible answers. I'm not saying that these are the only answers you have to use, no. Possible answers to use when somebody asks for a request, okay? Number one, it says, we are sorry. Si el request es para dos, tres, four, five, six people, okay? We are, we're sorry. We'll talk more quietly. For example, in your office, and your supervisor says, hey guys, could you please, slow down, okay, or speak um, lower. Oh, we're sorry, we'll talk more quietly. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, this is when the request has to do with, uh, you know, talking, okay, loudly. I'll do it right away. This is, ahorita lo hago, right? I'll do it right away. This is when a request could be like, could you, okay? Uh, could you um, could you make this uh, oh your husband for the case of the, 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 the girls 
who have a husband, uh, could you make a sandwich for me? Oh, sure, I'll do it right away, okay? Or in this case, can you send me the memorandum from yesterday? Oh, I'll do it right away. This is the answer, okay, you use when you want to say, lo voy a hacer en este momentito, ahorita, right? The other one is only sure, okay? Could you turn down the volume, please? Sure, right? Only like that. Are you kidding? This expression is like, ¿qué? ¿Está bromeando? <laughs> yeah, for example, when I ask uh, itself for $100, are you kidding, teacher? <laughs> I don't have any cash, right? I don't have any money, okay? But maybe in a credit card, but no cash. Cash means the money with you, okay? And the other one is, I'm really sorry, but I'm busy. This is when the answer for the request is negative, okay? This is when the answer for the request is negative and you can't do what you're being asked to do, okay? Then, sure, no problem, I'll be glad to. Sure, no problem, I'll be glad to, okay? Encantado, right? My pleasure, un placer, okay? That's it, or no, go ahead. Would you mind? Remember, estas respuestas con no van con el would you mind. Te importaría, okay? For example, um, would you mind? Uh, would you mind if I take uh, a candy from your bag? Oh no, go ahead, okay? Or when you are eating with your friends or your colleagues in the office, would you mind if I use your your if I use your uh, your napkin or in the office, would you mind if I use your pencil or pen? Oh, no, no, go ahead, okay? Those are possible answers, I said. Possible answers that you have for um, giving an answer, obviously, for the request you're being asked to, okay? Now, my friends, you are gonna work in making your requests, okay? In the... Uh, previously, I sent a, a document, okay, for you. That document, okay, has these uh, pictures at the beginning, right? And you have to make the request, okay? First, this is the first part. You have to make the request based on the following pictures. For example, the number one is a bathroom. And there are towels, okay, is wet. The second one is a television, a soccer match. And you see the sound is loud. The next is a kitchen with the bags, shopping bags all around still in the bags. Then number four is a cat scratching. Okay, this is like, hey, llamas a cargato. <laughs> okay, so you have to say that request, okay? And the next one is the garbage, okay? It's full, the trash can is full. So you have to use your uh, imagination with your partners to make this. Secondly, what we have is that then you have to use your imagination here what uh, what kind of requests do you usually ask to different people in the office? Well, when you were in the office, remember. To a client, according to your area, what kind of request, okay, do you usually ask for a client? To a coworker, a colleague, and to your boss. Look the level of formality. To a client, a co-worker, could be a friend. Can you imagine Gabby and, and Carlita? No creo que se hagan. Would you mind? No, right? <laughs> this is like, damn it. <laughs> or very formal, very formal. Ah, very formal, Carlita. <laughs> <laughs> y con doble, please, 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 pretty, please, sugar on top. Of esa course. Expresión, esa expresión es como porfa, porfa, sí, porfa, 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 porfa. Okay, this is when you're like, oof. You really want that request to happen, right? So to your, uh, to your coworker and then to your boss, what kind of requests do you usually ask, okay, to those people? So my friends, we have 20 minutes to finish this uh, worksheet and then I'm going to be listening to you 
okay, a checking, not only grammar, but also your creativity on this, okay? Try to go back in time when you were in the office and let's start working on this, okay? You already have this uh, document in your WhatsApp group, so you can use it there. Um, now we have more people in the class. So let's check, uh, we're gonna work, still, still, we have to work. Some of you are gonna work in pairs and some of you are gonna work in trios. Accept the invitation, please, right now. Hola, otra vez. Hello, teacher. Hello, hey, hi. Uh, Carlita Joana is with you. I don't know why she's not here. Let me let me check right now. Um, I'm going to assign another person for you. Let me check right now. Okay. Okay, Frank is coming to you. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Francisco is about to join the. Is he here? Yes, he's here. Okay, you can work with Frank. Hello. Hey, hi, Frank. I'm so sorry, but Exa, Exa was alone. So you're okay. going to work with Exa, okay? Okay, okay. Okay, Thank go you. ahead then. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Ah, ajá. A mí me cuesta saber qué significan esas cositas. El primero es. Teacher, un request. Ajá. With, would you mind? Uh, remember, it depends on the level of formality. Uh, the number one is with a, a to a client. So no, no, but the for pictures. the pictures. Ah, and the pictures. No, if you see those pictures are more like daily day, like like daily life, like in your house. Oh, so okay. obviously, in your house, you use can or could if you want to. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. One, maybe could you clean up the bathroom? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good. Could you clean up the Es que estuvieron yeah. ayer las preguntas, ¿verdad? Con cool y... Cool, can and would and would you mind. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. eh, down the next. Can tienen... you turn the music? Ustedes yeah. tienen de televisión. Uh -huh. de, de volume. Eh, ¿Ustedes tienen el link para ver las clases en el canal de YouTube? No. No. Se lo voy a mandar porque ahora en la clase antes se ponía en la plataforma, ¿se acuerda? Ajá. Sí. Ahora ya no. Ahora están en un canal de YouTube. Por el caso se pierde la clase, puede buscar el, la parte exacta mm. donde yo estoy explicando para que ahí no se pierda. Ah, ok. okay, okay. Eso lo voy a mandar. Uh -huh. okay. Gracias. Hello, Senia. Hello. Tenemos problemas con ella, no le puedo escuchar. Ay, 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 ay. 
Hola, Ocinia. Bueno, si me escucha. Bueno, no, aquí voy a chatear con ella. Se va a desconectar un ratito, ok, Itzel. Ok. Porque este, tiene problemas de, de inter. Eh, quizás la voy a mandar a otro, a otro room, porque si no, para que practique con los demás, ok. Ok. Itzel, ahorita lo muevo. Ok. No. Uh, Would you mind get out the garbage, please? Ah, okay. Out the garbage. ¿Cómo va el verbo si usan would you mind? Um, get in. Get in. Pero el phrasal verb ahí no es get out. Get out es cuando yo saco a alguien de la casa. Get out, salite, salite. ¿Ve? Pero ahí no es, el verbo no es, el phrasal verb no es para sacar basura, get out, es take out. out. Taking uh -huh. out. Ajá, exacto. To my taking, taking out. out the garbage. Ajá, ajá. Please, would you mind taking out the garbage, please? Mm -hmm. um, Sophie, the the no uh, is would you mind cleaning your garbage, please, because it's full. Ah, is the component? Yes, sir. Hello, teacher. Hey. I am reading your sentences. Yes. Mm -hmm. But, but uh, uh, the, the pictures, the sentence of pictures. Yes, I see. Uh -huh. Could you control? <laughs> Can you control your cat, please? <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe not control. Puedes sacar al gato, les. Uh -huh. oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> The cat is not crazy here. It's just like he's scratching because he wants to go may out to, 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 I don't know, to poo or something, right? I have control of my dog. <laughs> you have to go. Yeah, your dog is in the ee, one year old. Can you imagine? He's like seven years old kid. <laughs> Carlita says he's hungry. The cat. In English, Carlita. <laughs> y, y Carlita está con nosotros o qué? Yes, Carlita is with the view, but she has problems in her in her ah, microphone. Que sa. Yes. Uh -huh. Bueno, so Carlita she, she tiene las otras preguntas. Uh -huh. Frank, <laughs> yes, can you help? Can, yeah, eh, Frank, eh, Francisco, uh -huh. Carlita yes. can participate through chat, so she yes. can write her answer. Yes, she can. Of yes, course. you can. We have a uh, four requests, um, and, and you help, please. Okay, so Carlita, to a client, to your coworker, to your yes, Carla is mm -hmm. in the chat. I I can I didn't see the the chat. Uh huh. So you can you can have uh, here with uh, Carlita through the chat. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carlita is in the chat. Okay, continue. Put away, put back. Teacher, welcome. Hello, Joa. Mm -hmm. Hi, teacher. Here? Okay, I, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> Would you mind to remember after mine? The verb is ing. Remember, uh -huh. don't forget it. Turning, turning, turning. off. Mm -hmm. 
And, but also, okay, look, look. Eh, in this part, aquí donde están escribiendo, tienen que escribir ya los requests to a client y a un cliente no le van a decir, por favor, puede apagar su televisión. <laughs> no. Ajá, so, in this case, you have to use your imagination and tell me right there, what kind of request would you ask to a client? Okay, como PAE, ustedes, ¿qué, mm -hmm. ¿qué le pueden pedir a un cliente de ustedes? Right? Usando request. Con could, would, okay, would you mind? Pero aquí el would you mind turning off the TV, please, este no queda aquí porque no se le pide eso a un cliente. Okay? Teacher, teacher. Yes, Herbert. Y si podemos usar el turn down. Turn sí, down. Sí. Pero the volume, uh -huh, for the, uh -huh, number the volume. Two, uh, okay. For the number two. Uh -huh. Quiere decir, si esa es, would you mind turning off the TV, please? Es la respuesta de los dibujos. La respuesta no la escriban ahí porque ahí yo quiero que escriban las requests ya de la oficina, coworker y, y esa es la de arriba en la picture. Háganla en su cuaderno, ok, or any other. Uh -huh, uh -huh, okay. Uh -huh. okay. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Y sí, porque ahí se ve como que si a un cliente le dicen, would you mind turning off the TV, please? Ah, es que nosotros pensamos que la figurita la íbamos a usar no, para No, no, no. This is the first part and this is the mm. second one. Ajá, no, no, no. A client mm. is different. Ah, for example, me puede mandar, eh, ¿qué? El, el código would de... Mind, uh, ajá, uh, would you mind sending me, ok, an email about the last sales, please? Example, right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok. O si quiere que llegue a la empresa, right? O le importaría decirme a qué horas puedo llegar mañana. Would you mind telling me what time I can go to your office tomorrow? Ok. Stuff like that. Ok. A request that you use in the office. Ok. For the client. Y después ya bajan la formalidad y es para un coworker. Un compañero de ustedes, right? Okay. And then to your boss. Okay, okay, go ahead. Use your imagination. Okay. Trato y sacar la basura. Sí. Ahí podríamos... Yo... Teacher. Hello. Teacher, um, no en, bueno, acá en la, pre, perdón, va a ser en español. <laughs> uh, a main request based of the following picture is uh, the, the, oración, hacer oraciones. The sentences, the request. Uh -huh. Yes. For example, uh -huh. pero uno si se fija, está el desorden en el baño. Entonces usted diga, bueno, could you pick up the towels, please? La que hizo arriba. Muy bien, excelente. La segunda foto que tiene, un televisor a todo volumen, ¿verdad? Y le, le dice a la persona, por favor, le puede bajar de volume. ¿Ve? Can you turn the volume? Pero ahí le falta down. Could you turn the volume down? I need to make a call. Ok. Oh. Eh, la tercera, si se fijan, hay un, quiero ver, ¿qué es lo que tiene la tercera? La bolsa, ¿verdad? Del, del supermercado. Entonces, puede, puede ser, puedes, ajá, puedes este, poner este, las bolsas en la mesa. I don't know, something like that. Mm, ok, ¿Sí? ok. Que es un gato que está ahí va de... Ok. ¿Puedes abrirle la puerta al gato? Right? Oh, the request. Ok. Ok, teacher. That's, thank you. Ok. Use your imagination. Mm -hmm. Hagamos eso. Yo podría ayudar con una fórmula Excel. Mm -hmm. For a co-worker, or oh, yes, right? A co-worker. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. 
Can you can you help me? Uh -huh. Can you help me with Can you help me with with, uh, with ex this Excel, Excel formula? formula. Um, Excellent. Uh -huh. Excel uh -huh. formula. Uh -huh. Very good. Ahora si usted no se lleva uh -huh. mucho con el coworker porque es nuevo y la, o le tiene pena porque no son tan amigos, pues use ya un grado más de formalidad. Could, would, cool. or would. Uh -huh. Exactly. It depends. Okay. Uh, para el jefe. Mm. Lo dejamos con el el que agregamos el please. Ah, no por el. Uh -huh. Ah, es que. Ajá. Uh -huh. Pensé que le había puesto que así. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm Can you clean the bathroom up? Could you turn the volume down, please? Would you mind putting the purchases away, please? Could you get out the cut, please? In the Can number four, Carlita, I'm sorry to interrupt you, is take out. Take out the sacar. ¿Sí? Uh -huh. hey, take out the cut. Uh, uh -huh. Thanks. <laughs> get uh, out es como uh, que dijeran largar. Get out. Get out from the house. Era largar al gato. <risa> como eh, un, un angora más largo. Ah. Ok. Can you, es como el, la, la cinco, mira. Can you take the garbage out? O sea, agarrar el gato, sacar. Es como puede ah. picar piedra. Oh, oh, oh. Ok. Ah. Now, my friends, you have to use your imagination. Ok. And now, what I want you to do is to make requests that you usually ask to a client. But no according to the picture, no, right? No according to the picture. Uh, now is other. Okay, other other exercise. And this how is, many? This is more specific for your area. Two, two, two. Two, two for, for each. Yes, okay, go ahead because the time is running. Okay. okay. Uh, Um, could, you, could you sending sending me the lion you know remember oh, sorry teacher okay. could you send me the final um, Incident for the payroll. Let's see. It's okay. It's okay. Excellent. Okay. You. <laughs> um. Another Araceli. Could you? Could you please um, uh, Okay. Would you Apples, could you please could you please Send the send the request the request the history, verdad for for email. Okay. Could could please could. But is for a client uh, ah. of of the. The request, the interview with would you mind? Uh, okay. More formal. Mm -hmm. More formal. More formal. Okay. Would you mind sending me? Uh -huh. Would you mind sending me the first? Is, would you mind sending me the instructions for next week? Mm -hmm. When you, I, 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 I
Siempre que vaya a ser vía algo, digan by email. Ah, ok. O pueden decir vía email. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh -huh. uh, Gaby, and Hola. would you mind sending me by mail the instructions? Okay. Sending me the instructions. The by in mail. Uh -huh. By mail. Uh -huh. By mail. Así, teacher, le puedo yes. compartir la pantalla. Of course, go ahead. Would you mind sending the instructions to eh, ajá, ok. Allí hay una regla gramatical, acuérdese for, for making. O si no quiere decir making, pues diga to make. Como usted quiera, quítale el for y póngale tú. Uh -huh. Would you mind Make. sending the instructions by mail? Ajá, uh -huh. very good. Ok. Please. Ajá. Uh -huh. Please, that's it. Lo hace mucho más formal. Ok, that's it. Hagan dos por el tiempo. Pasen a coworker, okay. please. Ok. Ok. Coworker. Ok. This is more formal o less formal. Ah, depends. Okay. Uh -huh. Ahí van a jugar. Uh, can, could, uh -huh. it depends. Cool. Hilly, could you, could you, could you help me, please? <laughs> uh -huh, very good. Could you help me with the system? Uh huh. Or with the okay. program? Okay. Could you help me with the system? Mm -hmm. No. With, uh -huh, check. <laughs> mm -hmm. System, back on check. Uh -huh, system, excellent. Mm -hmm. Another request for, for a coworker. Eh. A veces decimos, puede venir, porfa. <laughs> Ok, other request. Other one that you use, que se prestan cosas, ¿no? Right? Yes. Me, uh -huh. Could you come Lend. Oh. Lend. Could you lend? Uh -huh. ¿Cómo se escribe lend? L -E -N -D. ¿Así? Lend. Uh -huh. Exacto. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Could you lend? Your calculator. ¿Cómo? Could you lend me your calculator? Ah, ok. ¿Cómo se escribe calculadora? Calculator. <ríe> exactly, calculator. Ajá. Uh -huh. Your, eh, Gaby, your, your, can you lend me your calculator? Excellent. Your calculator. Very good. Okay, now to your boss. To your boss. Yeah. Uh, Franklin. Ah, Franklin. So with Franklin, it's very nice because you say can, right? Uh -huh. It depends. It depends. <laughs> Come on, Franklin. Con Franklin hasta the imperatives, right? Uh -huh. <laughs> Hurry up. <laughs> when it's very formal. Mm -hmm. Is it not? They say, Can you hurry up, please? <laughs> yeah. Bye. <laughs> more form, more yes, form, more formal. Hello, teacher. Hello, Jesse. Let me check. Todavía le falta lo de abajo, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay. Speed up, speed up.
Skip me. Okay, again, me. Yeah. Almost finishing. Yes, right? Yeah. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Could you bring me the request? Can you give me, uh, let me check. Can you borrow me the scissors? Uh-huh. Okay. Can you lend me? Okay. Aquí, um, en la número uno de coworker, donde dice, can you borrow? ¿Sí? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Siempre cuando digan you, aquí el verbo ya no va a ser borrow, va a ser lend. Can you yeah. lend, can you lend me? Lend. Ok, ese. Can you el lend borrow, me? Lend. Con B. El B. Borrow, borrow lo va a usar si el pronombre es I. Can Solo I si es I. borrow. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Ok, can I borrow your scissors? Oh, can you lend me your scissors? That's it. Can you give me one page, please? Okay. Aquí si es una página, quítele la S a la page. Okay. Y can you bring me the request? That's okay. Mm -hmm. Very well. Okay. okay. Let's finish the last one, please. You have still one minute. Good to... Okay, guys, now that we are back, okay, we have uh, some, some exercises there. Pero estaba chequeando que no todo lo han terminado, okay? No, not everybody. And the, the, the idea is to finish this, okay? Some of you already have it. I have been checking, okay, the, the grammar. Okay, so uh, tomorrow uh, is the last uh, conference for this topic. So tomorrow at the beginning of the class, we are gonna check this exercise, okay? So remember, um, para los que ya lo tienen hecho, pues super nice. Creo que hay uno solo les falta esta parte, to your boss, okay? Hay otros que van apenas por client, okay? And the idea is that everybody participates, okay? So solo rapidito vamos a chequear este, cómo tuvo que haber quedado, tuvo que haber quedado. Can you clean up the bathroom, please? Can you clean the bathroom up, please? The volume, aquí es el volumen. Can you, could you turn down the volume or turn the volume down, please? These are, eh, can you put, okay, the bags away? Okay, or put the, the, the shopping bags away. Okay, the cat. Could you open the door for the cat, please? Or could you take out the cat, please? And the garbage is the same. Aquí vamos a usar el mismo verbo. Take out, sacar al gato y sacar la basura. Okay, este gato como, el, como que fuera el Flintstone, right? Okay, que gato, sale un Saca su gran gato a la puerta, ¿se acuerda? Ok, so similar. Y a Dino. <ríe> y a Dino, sorry, ¿verdad? Dino. Ok, so. Um, y lo otro es lo que más me interesa. Request for a client, request for your boss, and request for a coworker. ¿Qué es lo que usualmente le pide a ellos? que hagan por usted, ok? My friends, I have the attendance for today, so everybody please ready to say here I am or present. Yesenia Ivette Abarca Vázquez. Present teacher. Verónica Beatriz Aguilar. Verónica no. Beatriz Elso. Present teacher. Sorry. Carla Beatriz Aguilar. Uh -huh. Present. Osmani Etzaú de León. Present. Vania Itzel Deras. I'm here. Blanca Estela Marroquín. Present. Franklin de Jesús Martínez, absent. Eh, Carla Joana Martínez is present. Ella tiene problemas de audio, pero aquí está, ¿ok? Giovanni Alberto Orantes Flores. Present. Gabriela Beatriz Reyes. Present. Dalila Estela Silva, absent. Eh, María Araceli González. I'm here. Cine Elizabeth Mejía. Present. Sofía Guadalupe Hernández. Present. Juan Carlos Molina. Juan Carlos Molina. Present. 
Ok. Eh, Claudia Elena Cazún. Present. Brenda Lucía Rosales, también por acá, pero tiene bastantes problemas de audio, pero está presente. Herbert Iván Martínez. Present, teacher. Karen Lice Reyes. Present, teacher. Carmen Elena Cornejo. Present, teacher. En Francisco Isaac Cabrera. Present. Okay, excellent. Okay, that's it, my friends. Thank you very much for joining one class. Okay, one more class. Okay, this morning. I'm going to see you tomorrow. So remember, if you didn't finish the, the exercise, finish it because tomorrow you are going to share it uh, with me and the rest of the guys. Okay, remember the levels of formality can could, would, and would you mind, ¿ok? Ya para mañana tiene que estar terminada la sección 1, inglés corporativo, la administración va a estar dando seguimiento y si no quiere que le estén llamando a cada rato, pues hágala, ¿ok? Acuérdese que aquí le estoy dando, digamos, la explicación, pero aparte de esto, hay más ejercicios, hay lecturas, hay eh, también otros ejercicios de gramática que lo pueden ir haciendo. Cualquier duda o algo que no pueda hacer, escríbame, ¿ok? Send me a WhatsApp message to me. You have the number in the WhatsApp group. Have a beautiful morning, guys. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye, bye. 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 Bye.